Hey guys, welcome to the quick overclocking guide for the Asus Maximus 7 Formula C97 motherboard in combination with a Intel Core i5-4690K CPU quad core. This quick overclocking tutorial is just to show how you can overclock your CPU within let's say two minutes. You know the stock frequency of this CPU is around 3.5 GHz and the target CPU turbo mode frequency is 3.9 GHz means that one one core can go up to 3.9 GHz automatically. Um, first of all go to the AI overclock tuner and change this one to manual. Scroll down go to the one core ratio limit and change this one to 40. This will mean that your CPU will be clocked at 4 GHz on all cores, not only one. Scroll down and go to the CPU core voltage. You can see that the stock core voltage on my CPU is 1.040 volt. I recommend to change this one, raise it a little bit. Um, I tested before and 1.15 volt. It's totally fine, should be fine on all CPUs actually. This is quite low voltage for overclocking. And that's already it for 4 GHz. Uh, press F10, apply and let's go to Windows. I'm gonna use Windows 7, 64 bit version. For testing the stability of your CPU, you basically need three tools. You need CPU Z, this one here. The tool basically shows you all the details of your system. You can see you're running an i5-4690K CPU uh, at about 1.15 volt, which we just set in the BIOS. Core speed is 4 GHz on all cores, which you can see if you click, uh, do right click. You can see all cores running at the same speed. And you can see we are using uh, Asus Maximus 7 Formula. C97 motherboard. All right, the second tool you need is core temp. This one basically shows you the temperature of your CPU cores. And the third tool we need is Prime95. If you open this tool, change to custom, enter 1344 in minimum FFT size and 1344 in maximum FFT size. Check this one and just start. This will put the maximum load on your CPU and you can see the uh, volt, the temperature is now raising and the maximum temperature should not exceed 95 degrees or even 90 actually. Uh, you should keep this running for about let's say two hours and if that's running fine your CPU should be fine for, for gaming. If you want to know more and advanced overclocking, check out the second video.